Now, further, how to assign the paper? So, this is very important. This is a new thing for you. You will have to go to the RoboSS platform, log in with the branch login ID, okay? Go to the browser and uh, type roboss.robomateplus.com. You will get this screen. Log in with the branch ID over here. After you have logged in, as you go ahead, you will see this screen. You need to over here select the proper academic here, the board, the batches, the course, the subject level where you need to assign the test. Once you have selected all this, you need to click on the assign button. Okay, you are not going to make a paper, you are just going to assign. So click on assign. After clicking on assign, you will see a set of papers which are already been made. You don't have to hunt into that, you don't have to find over there. You will be on an Excel given the test codes. Okay, which are called as TM codes. You can see over here, this is written over here, TM code. So that TM code, you have to enter it over here. Okay, once you enter it over here, you will see that particular test. Once you see the test, you have to click on this button assign. Once you click on assign, you will be seeing the product level, center, batches, you need to assign, drop downs are there. You need to go on clicking and select the proper center the proper batches to which you have to assign. Once you select the batches, you will see the students in the batches. You can click on that and migrate these students to the assign level. Once you have assigned this, you will see below the categories wherein like the start date, end date you have to put in. You have to click on show solution immediate. If you click on, now here very important, if you click on show solution immediate, then immediately after submitting the paper, the student will be able to see the answer key and the answers. So please don't click on this only. Okay. We don't want this to be immediately solutions provided to the students. Let it be unclicked. If you remain, if you keep it as unclicked, then as the end date will come or end time will come after that automatically students, all students will be able to see the solution. So you don't have to keep show solution immediately. Unclick that. Then allow test, yes, you have to allow the test to resume. Show concept wise reports, yes, you can click on that. You have to select the template over here, the RoboMate template. And then finally, you need to uh, click on done. Once you click on done, make sure that you see this success screen popping up. Once this success screen pops up, means your test is properly assigned. So this is how you have to assign the test in RoboSS.